Stay in fine weather, ain't it? Sure is good. Yeah. up in the dark like that. Oh, it's you. I got his letter. Ah, uh, Mr. Arthur, 
Sir? Education is the most wonderful thing. It'll raise us higher and higher. Make civics and ethics less a work of uh, dirty-minded pragmatists like me. And the calling of higher, better men. Hear, hear. Without it, we are savages. But with learning, why, in 50 years, man will put down his guns and start living a life of relentless purity. Hear, hear. <laughs> but the rich can be so very self-absorbed. How can I help? You can't. We need all our strengths. That's the point. We've gone over this. Violence is never right. I agree with you. But it's not violence. It's the mere threat of violence. Against whom? Oh. <laughs> Against Hector Fellow's worst nature. To convince him to make good on his promise to help finance the library. Who is he and where do I find him? He's a newspaper man. And he's... He's a... leaving town on a coach, heading to his country estate, because he doesn't like your heavy-handed approach. Well, <laughs> he certainly won't like my heavy-handed approach. Thank you, Mr. Arthur. You'll spot him on the road through the bayou. He has a red coach. So we are clear, I do not approve of this behavior. the heck are you? Hold it right there. You're getting an extra passenger. When I get in, you carry on. What the hell do you want? Mr. Fellows, ain't it? Charity, sir. And an appeal to your better nature. This is most impudent. Oh, no, it's not most impudent. Trust me, buddy. I can get a whole lot more impudent, but this is a good cause for a wealthy man such as yourself. The chance to add some dignity to all that wealth. Dignity? By helping to finance a library in town. Think of the prestige. Sir. Oh, get out of my carriage. But the mayor. The mayor? The mayor is a crook. <sighs> me too. And I'm a real crook. I will not be bullied by you, sir. Get out of here. Oh, I'm sorry, was that 
Yes, I'd like to finance the library for the common good. Ah! I didn't hear you. You know, they say it's better to give than to receive. And certainly in the case of a beating, I know that's true. Now, the mayor awaits your check, sir. Been a pleasure. There's a good man in there. Let him live a little more. Driver, hold up. <clears throat> As you were. Drive on. Okay then, girl. Yeah. <laughs> Easy now. Hey, mister.
I'll be tending to you shortly. Morning, friend. Ready for a clean slate? Thank you for your help. Oh, dear. Have you come down with the flu as well, sir? Flu? No. What are you talking about? You leave something behind? Nothing. It's just been going around, that's all. Anyway, how can I help you? Take care now. Morning, sir. Morning, dude. Hey, friend. Good morning to you. Let's go, girl. Bonjour, monsieur. Hey, move it! Go on now. <laughs> yeah, I guess I'll settle down. Well then, that's seven cross for a while, eh? Good to see you. Ah, you make me feel young. Later, can home, ma. See, see, I'm not going to do it. Selling. Morning, my friend. Thanks for your assistance. Excuse you. What's he? Good morning, you hear? Very well, then. Good morning, Mr. 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 Good morning, Mr.